Hello and welcome to Invisible Gamer Plays. I'm Tristan. And I am Dan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're playing Mega Man 10. Um, there's a cutscene going. Let's see. Okay, Mega Man's going, uh. Uh, because he's tired. Because last episode we beat Blade Man, which is the last robot master, so. And this cutscene started playing, so I'm like, hey, let's start actually recording. Uh, Mega Man, are you okay? Good voice. No, he's been. Why is he different now? He's been infected by the virus of overeating. He, he's got cancer, and he's fat. Is that, I mean, those are all, <laughs> all three of those things are unrelated. <laughs> oh, so that robot, the same as Otto? Is he from, what game is he from? Otto, is he just I don't know where he, Was he in Mega Man 9? I, yeah, I think he was, yeah. Now that I think of it, I think he was, he was in the, uh, Oh, there he is. Wily's bad again, huh? Yep. Hope God you're enjoying damn, the, Wiley. the effects of my little Robloenza virus. God damn it. <laughs> what a fucking piece of shit! All you have to do is come to work. Who would trust him? He's not trusting at Isn't all. Isn't there another Mega Man game where he's like supposed to be good, and then that happens, and then he's bad again? Like every Mega Man game is. Well, like... no. I mean, like the first like three or something. He's there. Okay, all bad I think or... it was Mega Man Four where like but they did this. Supposedly, plot, basically. it was like Doctor Doctor Cossack, but it like he wasn't actually. A it real turned thing. out to be. It actually was Doctor Wily the whole time. I like how they Dr. That, Cusack? But I... John Cusack? Yeah, but... Did he have, like, a... Never mind, don't worry about it. Um, so yeah, There's probably Wally. a reference to that, but... Oh, it, even though he was... Okay, so I'm talking about Otto right now. Even though he was not introduced until Mega Man 7, it, was, it is implied that he's been with Dr. Light for a while. So he's Dr. Light's mechanic. Um, huh. So, yeah, I didn't, Mega yeah. Man 7 was his first appearance. So that's fun. Fun fact. So, roll. Mega Man, use this. I like... The art style of these games, very much. I like the little supporting characters that Mega Man, this Mega Man series, has created too, like Beat, yeah, and Beat Eddie, and, and Otto, uh, and like all these weird robots. Rush. Yeah, Rush is actually kind of like a different case because he actually like helps Mega Man out on the. the, the yeah, but he's still a cool little like side character. He looks like Pluto. I yeah, like him. yeah, he's cool. <sighs> okay, this is some plots. So she's he's better. Or whatever. Now we're gonna go she fight Doctor Wily. Cure, and then he's better. So it was just a little little Mega Man. Do, are we gonna thing. have to fight all the? Robot Masters again or something? Uh, like within Wily's stage? It's not all of the Robot Masters in this game, but we fight previous ones. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, they're, but they're wow. not. We're not actually fighting the previous ones. They're, it's like a little robot using the moves, so though. Look how it's kind of weird. Look how massive that castle is. Because for perspective, when you saw his thing going, yeah. Oh, why does it it's, look like that? Oh, I guess there's a bunch of different pranks path. Yeah. Um, when you see his little UFO flying in, it's like super tiny. Who is not realizing that this madman is building a giant castle with a giant, like, skull on it out in the middle of nowhere? Like, he, I mean, God. Even like, if it is who, in the middle of nowhere. Who would freaking trust him? I, like, yeah, Dr. Uh, Wiley's Um, I was gonna mention this earlier, I forgot, though. Um, did you see, I, I don't know if you have, you probably have. Somebody's making, uh, or modifying Mega Man Amiibo to be the Robot Masters from some of the games. That's so someone made a Snake Man amiibo. A Stick Man? A Snake Man. Oh. Snake Man from Mega Man 3. Oh, that's cool. And then he had like the green Mega Man toys like in the game or something probably. No, he made Snake Man. No, I know, but then like, cause you know you can program the amiibo to have like a certain color as your. Oh, oh, I'm, I get. It. I don't, I don't know. But he made like that packaging like, more... for it and everything. Yeah. That's, but it, that's, it, that's really cool. But is that, but he had the little Snake like... Man helmet. It, it, the the only thing is that he has. I don't know if the Robot Masters have the arm cannon like Mega Man does. Uh, some of them do, yeah. But all of them, all the amiibo that this guy's making are gonna have that because the Mega Man amiibo has it, you know. Yeah. But maybe he will saw it off or whatever. But I only saw make a uh, Snake Man. Maybe he's not making a bunch of them. Maybe that guy was just making Snake Man because it's his favorite or something. Yeah. But um, that's kind of weird because just like. Snake Man. Amiibo like customization is like becoming like uh, a thing now. Yeah, and then like people are selling it on like their Etsy shops and stuff, which is kind of cool. I like that. Like I would never take the time to do that. It, no, I I'm just not crafty like that, but it's still cool. I would buy some of them if they were like not super expensive and stuff. Yeah. Who's your favorite uh, Robot Master? Uh, I don't know all we, of them. Like so. in the and the stuff. classic Mega Man series, I guess. I don't like know. even ten and stuff. Yeah, one through ten. Um, I don't know. I kind of like Hardman. Why not? 
Why are you kidding? I think I have to go with Guts Man. He's like the most iconic robot master, I think. I like Middle Man, but I mean, he's kind of overrated, but... I guess I don't know enough of him. I like Snake Man because he's just so, like, out of left field. He's kind of weird. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I guess, I guess I'd have to like, look at a list of them again. And um... Remember. And I haven't played every Mega Man game, that's so... That's Ring Man. And I have no idea why his weakness is uh, the blaze shot. Oh, wait, are is that are these the guys from past games? Yeah. Oh, what? What? You're not actually like there's fighting a, there's them? There's a picture of them, but like it's a kind of like a robot like using the moves. Is weird. Oh, but oh, okay. It's like, like little training bots. Yeah. Okay, I got gotcha. you. Oh, so that's why there's three of them and then things, and they're weak to what the the actual robot masters were weak to. Uh. Or were you just using that? Cause I was just using oh, that. Okay. That's their weakness, like in like that's the boss weakness. Like, oh, gotcha. Right? It's not the actual robot master weakness, I'm sure. Because sure. that that was like Napalm Man and. Uh, what, what games are those guys from? Napalm Man is from Mega Man Five. Yeah, man. So considering getting uh, Mega Man Five on the uh, eShop, but I haven't even played Mega Man Four. Yeah, I don't know if you're missing out a lot on plot with these games. <laughs> nah, cause like, I, I just kinda wanna get like the best But yeah, like, get them in the order. One. But... I, uh, I wanna play Mega Man 5 cause it looks like the best, uh, I don't know, I mean, it looks better than 4, but uh, 4 looks still pretty good. Yeah, I think that most people they... agree that Mega Man 3 is that, I, I don't know, maybe not. 3 I... is my favorite out of everyone. Oh, oh that's saved because you have the, uh, the, uh, what's it called? Shock guards or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Um, I think I feel like three is the most beloved of all the classic Mega Man games. But I don't know about that. Like, like I don't really. I'm not tapped into the Mega Man fan base. I guess. I mean, you're just you're you're making progress. Yeah. What do you have? What do you have? Oh, well, is there? I mentioned this in a previous episode. Is there something in this in Wily's castle that you have to like use up a bunch of ammo for? Like in Mega Man 2? Um, I think so. To my memory, I think there is. Do you know like what it is weapon. and when that's gonna happen? Because we gotta we probably should be aware of that, so we're not stuck on it. <laughs> but yeah, I guess you I, can just get a game over and then that I actually different. don't even remember. I think there <laughs> is, so. Hmm. I'll take I'll I'll take it with me. It's probably just like a weakness thing. If, if anything. Like it's not like main. Not, not required. Okay. Well, that's good then. You can you could have taken one. You don't even have to freeze him. I bet you could have killed him right there. I believe you. Is this a boss or something right here? Uh, yeah. This is um. This. Oh, another one of these. Yeah, and then it's the end of the level. Walk okay. Cool. Uh, that sounds fun to me. Whoa! What is that guy? Um. I think he's gonna make him at seven. I have no That's idea. That's a who huge he is. robot master. And it just instantly killed yeah, I saw him that. with the commando bomb. Yeah. Uh, now it's Tornado Man. What's he? Oh yeah, he's with the Tornado Man from Mega Man Nine. I actually really like Tornado Man from Mega Man Nine. What's that guy? Wolverine Man. Slash Man. He definitely is inspired by Wolverine. There's no way he's not. Oh, E Tank. Now you did what I did. <laughs> But it's alright, because you're right here. He's from Mega Man 7, slash man. I think. Mm. Or 7 or 8, I don't know. Well, it's interesting, I, I don't know 7 or 8 very well. Yeah, it's interesting, because they, they make them 8-bit, but 7 and 8 were not 8-bit games. That's cool. Right? Uh, I seven, like how they do that. 7 was SNES, 8 was PlayStation? Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. It is kind of interesting that they had to transform them into 8-bit forms. They should remake those games and... Uh, like they should well demake those games. Oh, seven and eight. Yeah, I think that I feel like that would be actually pretty fun. That's pretty interesting. Yeah, I I don't know. I don't know how people feel about those games. Can you not hit him directly with it? I oh, can, it doesn't. But it it doesn't, doesn't do any damage, huh? Maybe just hit him with I, the mega I hate this part. It might be more efficient. <laughs> That's so close. It kind of sucks to have to use an E-Tank right there, huh? Because, uh, you, you didn't, yeah, you could have been fine. But you don't want to take the risk. It's so scary. Yeah. And you have, like, seven E-Tanks still. 
I and think plus, we'll be fine. I don't want to be pissed off from uh, restarting <laughs> five All million times. Yeah. All right. Oh. All right. That we made some progress, Dan. So we'll we'll we'll, we'll be on the next stage of Wily's Castle on uh, next uh, invisible game place.